this video i'm going to discuss sudden infant death syndrome or sids sudden infant death syndrome is a sudden and unexplained death of a baby younger than 1 year old sometimes a baby who seems healthy dies during sleep the exact cause of sids cannot be determined a combination of physical defects like brain defect and sleep factors can make an infant more vulnerable to sids or sudden infant death syndrome the incidence of sids is more common in babies who sleep on their stomach or their side and those who have a family history of sids that is a baby who is having a sibling who died of sids and the incidence of this sids is more common in premature babies or low birth weight babies and the babies born to mothers who had a poor prenatal care or who has a history of smoking or alcoholism or drug abuse other risk factors are exposure to passive smoking from smoking by mother or father etc or overheating while sleeping or too soft sleeping surface with fluffy blankets or toys etc the exact cause of this sits is unknown many researchers believes that sits is associated with problems in the ability of the baby to arouse from sleep and to detect low levels of oxygen or a build up of carbon dioxide in the blood that is when the babies sleep face down they may rebreathe exhaled carbon dioxide so normally rising carbon dioxide levels activate nerve cells in the brain stem which stimulates the respiratory centers and the baby then wakes up turns his head and breathes faster to get more oxygen but in case of the babies with brain defect or the problems with respiratory centers fail to detect the high level of carbon dioxide and the baby is unable to arouse from the sleep this will lead to death the triple risk model explains that sudden infant death syndrome occurs when three conditions exist simultaneously number 1 infant has an underlying abnormality that makes a child unable to respond to low oxygen or high carbon dioxide number 2 the infant is exposed to a risk factor and number 3 these two events occurs during a vulnerable stage in the development that is during infancy period that is from birth to 1 year of age sudden infant death syndrome has no symptoms or warning signs babies who die of sids seems healthy before being put to bed they show no signs of struggle and are often found in the same position as when they were placed in the bed sids is named the cause of death only when no other cause is found to find out the cause of death the medical experts review the clinical history and they will assess the death scene that is death scene investigation then the final option is autopsy how the parents can reduce the risk of sudden infant death syndrome doing certain things may help to protect the baby from sudden infant death syndrome and other deaths related to sleep that is number 1 always place a baby to sleep on his or her back number 2 don't use tobacco or alcohol or any drugs during pregnancy or don't expose the baby to second hand smoke during or after pregnancy number 3 keep the room at a comfortable temperature so that the baby can sleep without a blanket number 4 use firm sleep surfaces Number 5 keep fluffy blankets and stuffed animals out of the crib. Number 6 breastfeeding. Number 7 stay healthy during pregnancy. Number 
immunization some evidences indicates that immunization can help to prevent sudden infant death syndrome